Hey Jetty Rockers, welcome to Jetty Rocks Fishing. Today we're going to do another segment of the cleaning table. And today we're going to be cleaning a flounder. It's been a while since I've caught one, so it's been a while since I've actually cleaned one. So we're going to do one today, we're going to do a video. You get four fillets off of a nice size flounder. I, mean, I know there's some other ways of cleaning flounder, but in this video we're going to do that way where you get four fillets off, two off the top, two off the bottom. So I'll see you guys at the cleaning table. <laughs> Right, guys I got my flounder here got my three nice flounder and we're gonna go ahead and clean these up today it's been a while since I've actually cleaned a flounder but with flounder you actually get four fillets off the fish and I'm gonna show you how to do that basically you're gonna make a, an incision around the head here about like that and I like to come straight down straight across here so make a little incision, go straight across here, then you'll see on the flounder, you'll see a little indention right here where the lateral line is. And you're going to go ahead and you're going to cut straight down that lateral line all the way till you hit the backbone. Just like that, guys. Then you're going to take your knife, flexible knife, and you're going to just work that around. You'll feel it. Hear that clicking sound. Take your thumb in here so you can pull it up a little bit. You're just gonna work that fillet off. Just like that. Stick it right here through the tail. Cut that out. You just keep going with your knife here. like that guys okay then you'll see where this ends just put your knife through where that skin is come across same thing here there you go guys there's one of your four flounder fillets and you're coming through here do the same thing get your thumb in there I got a cat coming, wanting some fish. I hear him. And there you go. There's number two of your four fillets. All right, guys. Hey guys, well, we got the two fillets right here off this side. So we're gonna flip it over to the white side. Sorry for all the noise next door. They're working. We're gonna do the same thing. Sorry for the little shadow here. All the trees have grown up. Because of the summer now, I don't have the all the leaves off the tree like I do during the winter. So I got a little bit of a shadow here. We got a cat up here. Let's see if you can see this cat. Little stray cat. I call him Charger. He's just a stray cat that comes around. He wants some fish. So let me see if I can get him something real quick. Keep him happy. Here you go, Charger. He loves fresh fish, this cat. So we're going to go ahead and do the same thing that we did on the other side. Just going to move that knife along. Hold on, Charger. Stay back. This cat just came, showed up one day kind of adopted us so now we have a outdoor cat we have a couple outdoor cats actually that adopted us out here there we go 
go. There's number three filet. Flip this around. Oh, hold on, Charger. Make sure you work that knife along. That backbone. Oh, I hear you. Now you don't get as much meat off the back side as you do the front side. Like I said, it's been a while since I've cleaned the flounder, so I'm a little rusty. Here we go. Here we go, guys. All right, guys, I got my, my four flounder fillets here, so we're going to go ahead and skin them, which is really easy. Just take your knife along that skin just like you do any other fish. Voila. Beautiful fillet right there, guys. A little bit of bones right there. That's it. We'll give that to Charger. Here you go, Charger. There he goes. We got this one. Slippery little bugger. So I think I got most of the bones off that note right there. Okay. Nice little flounder fillet. Alright, then we got the, the backside fillets here. Beautiful fillet. They're not as thick as the front size fillet. Here's the front shoulder fillet. Here's the back shoulder fillet. This one's much thicker than this one. But man, it's good though. Take that stuff off right there. Give that the charger. Get this one right here. I'm going to get the rest of these clean, and I'll get back with you guys in a little bit. Hey, Jetty Rockers. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Thank you very much for watching it. You know, just a real quick way of cleaning a flounder. You know, you get the four fillets off of it, two off the top, two off the bottom. It's a fairly easy way to clean a flounder. I know there's some other ways out there to do it. Maybe in the future, I'll uh, sh shed some light on those, those ways of cleaning a flounder. But this is my favorite way to clean them. This is the way I clean them the most when I do catch one, but it's actually been a while since I've caught a flounder. It's a couple, couple years since I've caught one. But the flounder are running pretty good right now, so hopefully we'll actually get some more. And I hope you guys enjoyed the little uh, special appearance by my little stray cat charger. <laughs> he's adopted us and he loves us. And as you can see, he's pretty friendly. He gets up there and eats the fish. It's kind of funny, but that's, that's charger. Well guys, I get to see you again soon here on the water. Tight lines. Hey Jerry Rockers, thank you very much for watching this video. I'd like to invite you all to go follow me on my Facebook page at Jetty Rocks Fishing and also my Instagram page. I also have a JRF apparel page which will send you a link to my Teespring page where I have some cool shirts and some mugs. I appreciate you guys very much. I'll check out the description in the bottom of this video. I'll have the links. Tight lines, Jetty Rockers.